Yo, 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 what up, what up, what up, what up, what up? I'm back. I'm back. Miss Princess, what up? Let's get it lit again. You know what time it is already, B. You know what time it is already, B. Niggas doing siding on the house all week. I can't even do no interviews. Like, niggas doing all kinds of shit. Yo, new era podcast, what up? Rainfall, what up? We got Danny coming on. Got a lot of shit to talk about, son. Nah, this one ain't this. This one is a disaster. This one is Danny. I got disasters coming on, too. You already know, son. You already know. You know what time it is already, bro. You know what's going down today, man. I got to figure out what's going on. Let's get to the bottom of this, man. Let's get to the bottom of this. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. I see the guest. Yo, 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 bar guy. Top of the morning. Top of the morning. What's good with you, bro? Shit, man, I'm chilling, man. War mode, you know? <laughs> okay, okay. Look, first things first. Shout out to Stiz Battle Rap Academy, Enes. Talk to me about the Enes battle. I'm hearing some good. I'm hearing it was a war. It, it was fire, man. That shit was so fun, and it, it was, uh, it was a good experience because I was able to go to a hostile Philly crowd. You know, everybody was telling me, Jay Black, when I got to the city and I did champion, everybody was like, yo, Danny, I know you done been everywhere. You ain't been here. I'm like, really man, I'm like, man, I didn't, I didn't been to all kind of places. They like, nigga, you ain't been to Philly. This, this is different out here. Boy, they was not lying. Same. I went to host a battle over there when Sway Battle Easy years ago and all that. Yeah. So I'm the host, cautioning all of them is there. Like, it's mad people there. These niggas is just talking. I'm just like, yo, they talking during all the battles. They want to hear nothing until Rain Man came on. <laughs> I said, yo, this is great. Yo, we're looking at Philly, but they don't play. Hey, man. They don't play. Philly, Philly is, is, is really, I, I really felt like the Philly versus everybody vibe. Like, yeah, we, we, we rock with you, Danny. We rock with you, but but Enes is our man, bro. This is this is Philly, and so it's a super tough crowd, man. But I was able to fight through it and win them over. I was able to win them over, so that's what made that's what made the battle even better because it felt like it felt like Rocky versus Drago and Rocky fought Drago in Russia. It was all going for you know what I'm saying they was going for Drago, but by the twelfth round they start cheering for Rocky. So that's how it felt. Like my first round, it was all crickets. You know, I did the, I started off, you know, imitating that style. Crickets. Nobody said nothing. I'm like, ah, oh, <laughs> shit. I'm like, ah, oh, shit. I'm spitting bars, no reaction. I'm spitting bars, no reaction. So it's like, damn, they really, they not fucking with me. Then he started rapping. It's pandemonium. I'm <laughs> Yeah, I like it's gonna be one of these nights. But by my second round, I'm going so crazy. They had to. They they. I I, I broke through. I broke through. You gotta win them over. You gotta win they, them over. They finally started giving me the love in the second and third, man. And it was right. it was a back and forth. It was crazy, man. Yo, shout crazy. to friends with the grippers. I see you, gorilla. Mm hmm. Yeah. So shout out to Philly, man, because it's like. That's a legendary city. That's a fact. So that's part, yo, bro. That that was the first New York versus on that, camera it was versus Philadelphia. It was versus Philly. Yeah. So I I never like I battled easy to block captain. That was the first time I ever battled a Philly battle rapper, and but that was in Virginia, I, I believe. So mm -hmm. I I haven't never and then when I battled Don Marino, it was like in in Derby. So it was like out outside of Penn, outside of Philly, I believe. So that wasn't uh, really Philly. Plus, it was, Philly. plus it wasn't a Philly battler. It was it was on Gates of the Garden, so it wasn't Philly. So this yeah, yeah, was yeah. my first ever Philly Philly battle in Philly on a Philly league versus a Philly battle rapper. So that was a a big move for me to check that mm. off my my battle rap bucket list. Bucket the battle yeah. in Philly in a hostile environment, but. I, I'm so good. 
I won them over, and they wasn't trying to mess with me at all. <laughs> you, you won? Did you win? In your opinion? I, I, I definitely – like, here's the thing. Okay. When when you're battling – I feel like when you're battling – I'm going to tell you what I heard. I'm going to tell you what I heard. Okay, go ahead. I heard you were going crazy. But every time you went crazy, he went crazy. Every single time. They said it was like the most lyrical nest they've seen in Mad Long. I, you said some shit and be deep, and they said he would. I don't, I mean, bar for bar, I, I feel like I definitely got not, the back. Bar for bar is not close, you feel like. Nah, man, hell no, nah, man. This thing is saying some shit about, he said, and I still got the ball head because I don't use the shampoo. And they went crazy. Oh wow! Okay. This nigga said he said the first thing. This they said he said guess what this nigga what he said guess the first thing this nigga Danny did asked me for puffy number and they just went crazy. I'm sitting here like <laughs> I'm like that's that's a bar like <laughs> but but I get it like that's history. history. That's Nest style and 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 the thing is I also want to cry um. Pat my own, pat my own back, cause I battled Ness and I didn't use no making the band bars, I didn't use no puffy bars, I didn't use no cheese, cheese, no cheese steak, steak bars, steak. no DNA bars, no DNA bar. I didn't use no 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 Ness flips. I battled okay. him with bars, and this I think this was the first time in his career somebody actually just came at him without. With any of that, about, about, about the past angles, yeah, yeah. And he told me before the battle, he said, "Well, if you don't use none of that, what do you really have to say to me?" I said, "I really don't have nothing to say. I mean, you're a legend. What can Directly I say to you? Mm. Yeah, what can I say a bad about you? You know what I'm saying? Like everybody loved Ness, man. So it was like, let me just put on a, a display of bars versus what you do. So when you call the battle." If you like the, the performance entertainment, then he won. If you like mm -hmm. the pin, he I won. So it's it's just one of them to me. Mm. Let me ask you a question. Did this all right? Besides it being on your bucket list, well, it already helped you number one, because you had never been in that kind of environment before, you said. Right, right. So you already you already learned from that how to like, like all right, so what did you take from that? That, I, you being in that, in that kind of environment, like I'm what, what real, is that? I'm a real warrior, and I feel like more more battlers should go to Philly. More mm -hmm. I, like more battlers should go battle in Philly, cause it's mm -hmm. a whole. I done been to Chicago. I done been to New York. I done been to. I done been everywhere. You know what I'm saying? I've been mm -hmm. down south. They give mm -hmm. you love for the most part. If you cooking, they giving you love, man. But Philly is like, especially if you going against one of theirs. It's you like, earn oh, you're, the, you're the real op. Yeah, you got to earn that. real fucking, you're the bad guy here. We don't like you. So, But that's good, though, because now you know what terrible. it feels like with your back against the wall. Yeah, it builds literally my back against the wall. Like, it builds character. It shows you what kind of battler you are because most battlers in my situation, they would have folded after the first round. Niggas would have choked. Niggas would have started complaining to the crowd. Oh, y'all don't fuck with me. Y'all niggas being biased. Oh, y'all don't like me. All right, fuck y'all. Whatever. I see what type of battle. It was It was literally almost the same thing for Show Off versus Kaboom. Mm. Like, Show Off had a, he had to fight and fight and fight for reaction. And Kaboom was getting, I mean, they, these guys were at home, man. I mean, it's. it's All right, wait. All right, hold up. Hold up. All right, they was at home. I get that, but how were their performances? Fuck that at home. They were great. They were great. No, they did were Kaboom great. beat Show Off? Cause that's what I'm hearing. You talking this at home shit? That that's not really helping me right there. That means it's biasness saying that. Now I'm, I'm not so saying that Kaboom they beat Show Off. They gave us both love, but it's, it, we had to like really. They wasn't giving us nothing. Like you had to. Of course earn. not, bro. If you know the the, the Philly battle rap. History, you know they're not giving you nothing. You already know that. <laughs> you know what? They probably, yo, they're probably the most aggressive. When, when it comes to battle rap, they're the most aggressive. Yeah, yeah. But like the whole city full of Geechee Gotties down there. Yeah, I know. I, and I, I love it, though. I love it because I'm from that same environment. You know what I'm saying? I keep telling people, like, I'm good everywhere I go because of where I came from. You know what I'm saying? Me and Jag, we from South Central LA, and it's nothing but you know what I mean? Like it's it's really like that out there. So 
when I go to these other environments that's similar, like when I go to Flint, Michigan, or I go to Detroit, I go to Philly, it's the same vibe. Like, damn, like, you really got to watch your back and shit. Hey, nigga, you said you a battle rapper, right? And this what you do? Right. And, and I pulled uh, up. I, can go, and I don't want to hear no complaints. Right. And I pulled up. And I pulled up. And I pulled Dolo. I pulled up Dolo. You know what I'm saying? Like, so they really respected me for going to North Philly on some, like, damn, Danny, you really out here? Like, boy, do you know where you at type of shit? Like, the goons and the goblins. Bro, you know what's crazy? Everybody that I talked to out there, they was like, bro, it's dangerous out here, bro. I'm yeah. like, come on. I said, I don't want to I don't want to keep hearing that, man. Like, because y'all. Niggas real. Niggas getting head tapped out there left and right. Bro, I said I don't want to. That I don't want to be. That's the only thing. Every time I talk about Philly, that's the first thing I bring up. Literally, that's the first thing everybody said. Bro, okay, so look, my uh, I was I was. They got my room down downtown Philly, so I'm okay. I'm staying at the Warwick. It's a nice nice hotel. I, I find a little Seven Eleven around the corner from there, and I'm talking to the the, the cashier, and she's like, "Oh, where are you from?" I'm like, "Oh, I'm from L.A." And she's like, uh, what, have you been anywhere in Philly? I was like, nah, I ain't really, I, I haven't went to North Philly, South, Southwest, none of that. She's like, stay here. <laughs> she's like, stay where you at. Don't go nowhere. I'm like, what? what you? She's like, it's dangerous out here. I'm like, damn, it really is like that out here. I'm like, that's crazy. Yeah, nigga, what the fuck? <laughs> I, I'm not saying, but hey, listen, listen. Like L.A., uh, Detroit, uh, Chicago, Philly. Flint, Baltimore, Louisville, Kentucky. Like it's 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 wild everywhere for real. But I think Philly was the it's like it it really was like the whole city was telling me, yo, bro, be careful. Yo, about bro, it. Danny, you got some you got like like you said, it's real everywhere, but you got them certain states and cities that that's where that's just what it is right there. Yeah. And and everybody and, don't and, got and, that. Philly's one of them, I feel like. Bro, I, I wanted to talk to them about Philly food, Philly music, Philly culture. The first thing they, they all the conversation started with, bro, be careful out here. I'm like, God damn, let me get my ass back to Cali. Let me. I was going to say that shit, but spit your three rounds to get the fuck up out of there. So I'm, like, <laughs> let me get I'm not going. Yo, having this conversation, you got me second guessing this shit. Like, yo. <laughs> I, like, I want to go. Me, I want to go pull up on a little Frank battle and shit. I like. I let me get the fuck. Let me get the fuck out of here. Now, nah, but actually, it was all it was all love. But you know, um, yeah, Ness Ness is a legend, and honestly, it didn't hit me till after the battle. I, I'm talking about after the battle. I said, wait a minute, I just battled E Ness. Yep. And I used bed. to watch yep. him on. You know what I'm saying? When he used to put the little the towel over his shoulder. I mm -hmm. I'm putting a towel over my shoulder. Copycat ass nigga. Yeah, but it, it was yeah, but he, he was such a, a influence, man. And him going to battle Jay Mills and all that, his whole history. I, it didn't hit me that I had battled a real like star, bro. I'm like, yo, this guy, cause his his, his stardom transcends just battle rap. Like the mm -hmm. man just went to did a song with Benny the Butcher in Atlanta. Like he's 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 making moves like he does his shit, like yeah. you know. And I'm sitting there like, yo, this this is Enes. I just battled in Philly. Like if I had battled, it still would have meant something. Anywhere else, nah, it would have. It's different though in Philly. Or it That's is what different. I'm saying. Like if I had battled them on like King of the Dot or or URL somewhere in New York, like it, it don't it's mean that. Nice, but it's not. You got the you got the whole you got bullet if you got Ness on a hundred. He in the city, he in right. the hood. Right, right, right. Shout, so you're shout back to, against the war. It's your first. To, yo, you never even been there before where you could link up with niggas that you met before. You literally is there by yourself. Like, hey, I'm Danny Myers. Look at me. Like, hey, shout, <laughs> to, shout to Frank with the grippers. Uh, uh, shout to Frank with grippers. Uh, uh, Frank, what up, girl? Bars McVay, uh, Show Off, Kaboom, Stiz, Rick, the whole, everybody that was involved. Um, but yo, I didn't hear from Bars McVay in forever, yo. He did. He he did well. He did well. <laughs> you know, he you know, he 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 got a lot of performance with him too. A lot of energy and shit. I got, I want to see that one. I want to see that one. I haven't heard from him in mad long, Bars McVay. Yo, all right. It's I gotta ask. You. I gotta ask you this. I gotta ask you this. 
And don't don't be biased because this nigga's in the comments. I should cut the comments off. All right, nah, nah. I need to know what happened with Frank with the Grippers versus Merck. Oh, I I, I can't tell you because I I didn't I didn't I was outside like okay. interviewing okay. and I heard all I heard like was just a bunch of cheers and cheers like coming from the from upstairs type shit. So I'm like, oh, somebody in there cooking. Or somebody's crazy. getting cooked. <laughs> so I, I don't I, I, I can't tell you. Okay. I didn't see okay. It. Nah, yo, Frank with the Grippers is my favorite rapper out of uh out of Philly and shit. Like wow. the whole pop class was going on and all that. Like, when everybody when everybody was a fan of Reed and everybody was a fan of NH and Kaboom, I was a fan of all them niggas too. But if you really was paying attention to what, what Frank with the Grippers was going was doing, it was just like, nah, this nigga's a whole different type of animal. And Eddie Morris is a beast. I thought this thing was kind of sicker than every Morris. It's like, so that's my favorite rapper out of Flea. So I'm always gonna be cool with that nigga and shit. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm I'm so mad that I missed uh Frank with the Grippers performance, man, to see him live. Like, cause that's that's all so legendary. Like, just yeah. like, bro, like you don't understand how important. Well, you you know, cause you always big up Philly, cause you know how integral their role in battle rap is. And and yeah. Ness was like, man, every battle rapper has some Philadelphia DNA in their <laughs> rap style. Like, and I was like, I, I really couldn't even refute it. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, he got a he got a point. Like, and I think oh, Philly uh, Pipe don't your really face, grittiness. I don't care who you is. I'm, I'm saying, like, I'm here to annihilate you and kill you a million times while I look you in your eyes. And like, like they got their own style, bro. Like the whole vibe is so different. Like they, they got your master Lee word. You talking about when he battled, um, when he when 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 Frank battled, um, God damn, I can't think of his name. He had the, he had the army fatigue hat on. Oh my God, he can't. Hey, is, that Eddie Moore. Moore, is that Eddie Moore? Damn, I didn't even know Eddie Moore did the chat. Yo, shout to Eddie Moore, B. See what I'm saying? Yeah, Many niggas tap in because they already know what's up. <laughs> you they already know what's up. Hey, shout out, shout out to all of them, man. But honestly, that that was that was real special for me was to go and battle in Philly, man. That's what's up, right? I done battled on King of the Die, RBE, URL. You know, I done battled the small leagues, but I never can battled. Yo, can we be real here? Can we be real here? I don't want to say it like this, but I feel like this is what it is. They're being blackballed. They're being blackballed. I don't want to say that. And hear me out. I know weed is on you all, bro. I know Cicero has had a URL look. I kind of feel like, now I know Eddie Morris, you know I'm fucking with you. I want my interview, so it's still fuck you till I get it. But you know you my nigga though. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> but yo, um, they don't, they don't, they don't get that. I'm not saying number one, Philly shouldn't get favoritism because of what they did back in the day. Nah, no, I want to be clear on that. No. I want to be clear on that. I don't think they should get favoritism. But I do feel like they play such a detriment part to the culture. It's just like, them niggas don't get looked at first. It's like, everybody goes around everywhere, and then they come to Philly last or find excuses to not battle them. You know what I mean? Nah, I, I, I honestly feel like, let me tell you, like, honest to God, from my whole battle career, I always felt like you wasn't validated until you went to New York and battled. And okay. that still kind of remains true, but okay. after battling in Philly, Man. Nah, you know what? All right, wait. I, I gotta feel put like, I feel like you me. ain't really seen, you ain't been in the Lions Den till you battled in Philly with one of they men. Not you can't like it. Like if I go battle Geechee Gotti over in Philly, it's no, no. I ain't talking about that. I'm talking about me versus Reed Dollars, me versus Frank, me versus Eddie. Like you know what I'm saying? You got to go battle a Philly nigga in Philly to really. Nah, but mad That's niggas didn't battle. Character. But look though, but mad niggas didn't battle Philly niggas in Philly. I know Rest that. Didn't battle the nation I, Philly. I know that. That's what I'm saying. Like I, we gotta. But you can't I, say that battle don't count because that was about that that. You know what I'm saying? You I'm can't saying, say it don't count. What I'm saying it is, it took for me to go out there and battle Nets to realize, yo, this is highly important for battle rappers to come out here and battle these guys in their time. And I told I told Nestor's You know what? You is right, though. You is right. You is right. Because I feel like, now that you say that, not to cut you off, but I do feel like if the Philly niggas go battle elsewhere, it may not be perceived the same. At least the town know what they're looking for over there. I think you is kind of right yeah, on that. I told Ness, I said, Ness, you got to come to L.A. and battle. Like, I ain't seen you come to the West. 
I, so, I, I, Frank with the grippers. Tell him to come to the West. Hey, hey, Frank, here, get you up. Let's let's get something on the right. You feel me? Like, I feel like everybody should at least touch the the, the, the respective regions. You know what I'm saying? It shouldn't just. And Matt Hoffa had put out the tweet like, "Oh, smack." Uh, bring these West Coast, make these West Coast niggas come over here to the East. Like, my nigga, Matt, I told Matt, bro, we started over there. I mm. I had to do all no, my PGs true. over there. Geechee had to do his PGs over there. I didn't have to battle Steams in Brooklyn. I had to battle Rex in Harlem. I didn't have to go battle DNA in Queens. I was like, not, now it's turning around to where yeah, people yeah, yeah. got to come to the West and see and see us in our backyard for once. You know what I'm saying? It's always been you got to go to New York to get to get validated. Like now, I feel like you got to come to the West and, and battle. I feel like Mook should come to the West. Lux should come to the West. Um, Lux did go to the West, but it, but that was like the caffeine shit. He battled. So wait, so wait. Is caffeine the new home base now for you all, bro? Absolutely, I, absolutely. So everybody come. Everybody got to go there now. That's all. Um, but that's still not because it's closed. It's not. LA, you get what I'm not saying? Eddie Morris. We know you've been all run on road game. I know you battled Midwest Miles. You had the white do rag on and all that. I remember all that shit. Like, has Eddie every, Morris, but, but I would think y'all definitely travel anyway. Has Eddie Morris battled in Oakland or Los Angeles? I don't think, to my knowledge, no. I know about that. I know has he did Brandon battle, the battle, battle in Oakland that. or Los Angeles. Those are those are important markets to touch. Can I tell you what it is, too, though, Danny? Like, what it is also, I feel like, is when it came in terms of L.A., like, all right, now y'all got Geechee and all that shit, and you would run Liddy, but when you was really looking at L.A., that was more of a grind time thing. I know. And I, I kind of feel like because it was more of a grind time thing, that's why URL, I don't want to say so much made it about New York. about was trying New to get York, the jungle that's where they're from also, but it was on some week, all right, the L.A. got these niggas, we doing this. I think that kind of hurt L.A. also because then y'all got perceived as some grind time niggas for the most part. I feel like, okay, yeah, you're right. Honestly, you're Where right. Where am I reaching? No, you're right, you're right. But I think when Daylight came in and, and, and battled uh, Philly Swain, I think that was like mm. the ushering in of take, take this West Coast shit, the street side of L.A. serious. Like, mm. and then you get me coming in. Then you get Rum Nitty, then you get Geechee and B Dot. Yeah, but look at how long, nah, nah, nah. But look, look at that big ass gap that just jumped. Yeah, you know what I mean? From daylight took, to Geechee and all that. It took. It, I wasn't consistent. No, no, but but I think now, I think California you know, versus a post, Philly card. Wow, that would be crazy. Oh uh, yeah, a County that, versus Philly card. Call call Stiz and call Gucci and, and and get them to get that. That's two leagues right there. They 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 can figure something out. Academy versus Riot, you know, and we do it in L.A. I said that shit. I or oh, and then, then I threw Dre Dennis in there. Throw Gates in the garden up in that bitch. Yep. yep. Y'all got leagues that's making noise. This is what I was saying years ago when it was spit that heat. Black Ice Cartel and like and like um Gorilla and Warfare. Cali, you had leagues that was making noise. Nah, matter of fact, it was spit that heat. We go hard in Trap House, New York. Um, Bane, shout out to Bane. He said, "Battle Ice Pack in St. Louis." That's that's exactly what I'm gonna do next. I, I, you know, me and Young Ill in St. Louis. Yeah, that's what I want to do next. Like, cause I'm, I'm, I'm a nigga that's gonna show up to to your backyard and against all your people, and I'm gonna get busy. You know what I'm saying? I don't need no home game. I don't need no. You feel me? I pull up. <laughs> I'm, I'm for real, for real. 